What's up guys, it's Loka back here with another fucking lit video. Today's video is going to be a requested video you guys have been dying. I mean dying to know um, by the title of this video, you know what we're going to be talking about. We're going to be talking about my tattoos. About my tattoos, so many people, so many people requested this video. They wanted to know about my tattoos. They want to know things about my tattoos and what do they mean. So this is going to be the video today about my tattoos. I've done an old video on my old channel about my tattoos, but it was kind of like not the real one because I was so young and you know, I had my baby daddy telling me all this stupid shit. First, let's check the outfit of the day, shall we? We got a nice black hoodie and then I got these these pants from rule 21 bomb ass cargo pants and then not cargo but and then I would wear like my black I mean my white gym shoes but I'm going to change during the end of the video and you guys are gonna help me pick my outfit out I just messed up my makeup you need time you know first tattoo I think my first tattoo ever was has to be this little l right here i was 15 years old and um it was for luquita um i had joined a gang and my gang name was luquita and it's still luquita um that's when i got when i was 15 the next day i got this one it means 5150 it looks really really bad right now because like it's old, you know, and my eyebrows like changed throughout the years. But hey guys, I didn't like explain inside the video what this tattoo meant. Wait, this tattoo meant. Um 5150 stands for psycho or insane. I got it because my name was Loquita and I'm a little crazy, so that's the reason why I got that one. Okay, the next one I got on my face, I'm going to not go in order. So what else I got on my face is my daughter's name, Genesis. I got my daughter, her, her name is Genesis Jolice Clemente. And I decided to get her name on my face because I miss my daughter and I haven't seen my daughter in a minute. I, I got the Illinois sign on my face as well. Because that's where I was born, Illinois. I got 6-9 on my face. 666 is an angel number and this is why I got it. I slept on the metro last year. I was homeless for a while and I didn't tell you guys that. I mean, some of you guys can see that I was going place to place. But not once that I want somebody to give me sympathy so... Or feel sympathy for me so... <clears throat> I've been through a lot last year. I lost four people from an overdose. It's just, it was really hard for me. 666 is a sign of release. Um, I released all that shit, negative energy that year. And then 999 to me is a sign of reflection. It means sign of reflection. So whatever happened last year, I promise you it's going to be different this year. It will reflect on what happened last year, but it's going to reflect it in a good way, in a positive way. That's what I got on my face. Now, look, I got it on my face. People say I'm stupid, all this shit. Yeah, I might have been stupid putting it on my face. But I felt like at the moment, at that time and place and time in my life, I wanted to put it on my face. So, you know, I don't think that I made that bad choice. Next, going down, we got what goes around comes around. Now, I got that on my face, on my neck, because I really, I got it in that area. Cause I seen a girl have it in that area and I really, really fucked with it. Um, I got to get it like covered. Like I got to get it shaded in. Okay guys, so I didn't explain it that um, tattoo either. So this one I got because karma is real. What goes around definitely comes around. And I got it when, you know, Brian did that to my daughter. So that was kind of why I got it. And I really want that right there. Cause it was really cute. Hides like your neck but got it because karma's a bitch but yeah the next one under that is my my kid's father's my kid's father's name i got to get that either removed or crossed out on top i do plan on doing that i just don't haven't got around to it yet and that's just my 
personal issue. That's no one else's personal issue. That's just my personal issue. So next I got a 13 here. And I joined a gang, pit one and two together. I got that when I was 17. I got this one when I was 15. My ex-boyfriend did that. He was like one of the love of my life. So he was actually my first love ever. <sighs> yeah, that's a story. Uh, we're getting deeper, we're getting deeper. Okay, so I got these. It is a dollar sign. These are two triangles and these one is a heart. I did these stick and poke all by myself. Um, let's see. Next, we got red rum. Let me take my ring off, y'all. Look at this ring. I bought it the same next day. My fucking, I had my got my my eye tattoos. And I, what a coincidence! But I got this. It means red rum and spells murder backwards. M U R D E R, red rum. Then I got these playing, playing cards. I actually you got a fix across my knuckles. Then going down my hand, we got some three roses right there. I got those when I was 18. Then I got this beautiful girl, which is my mama. My mama. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Then we have Samantha. Okay, don't mind the scar. That probably can be a story time if y'all want. Okay. Then we got my daughter's hand with her birthday on top like a bracelet. We got my, th my three dots. Those mean my crazy life. But to me, it was for gang affiliation, okay? I'm just being honest with all my tattoos this time. All right. <clears throat> so next tattoo I got is we got stay blue right here stay blue you know next i got a flower on my butt a lot of people see that one a lot of people don't la right there my crazy life right here mi vida loca Um, oh, <clears throat> I also got, damn, y'all just see me on my chonies. Okay. I also got Medusa right here. I did this bad boy by myself. I did that bad boy by myself. Um, then I got this butterfly right here that I got to finish. I feel like there's some hidden. Oh, I got one on my foot. I did when I was 15. No, yeah, 16. I just stick and poke as well. I have this R right here with a little heart and it says R and it was for Robert and that's one of my best friends. I got a cross right here. You see like the little the little ones that are put in. Got a cross right here. But those are my tattoo guys. I don't think I like missed any. So I'm gonna go be going out today and I need to help pick something girly so you guys are gonna help me. this top and it is from Shein super super cute super cute then I'm also going to top with some of these pants high-waisted cute pants ugly wear ugly wear if you guys like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, scoop, subscribe to Loka's channel every time you get it. Oh, fuck, why can't I do my outro?
All right, guys, if you guys like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to Loka's channel. Hit that bell button to get all notifications every time I post a YouTube video. I really hope you guys enjoyed my tattoos. Also, if you guys did, can you guys please click the link down below and go do your daily vote to every, every day so I can win. Help Loka win this ink cover girl ink magazine whatever help me win this babe because after this it's just up from here it's just up from here hope you guys love it and i'll see you guys next time bye